Hello. So, I'm just gonna be talking over this video. I think it's just me fighting someone on my friends list, Mr. Rothstein. He's a, a king main. As you can see, he has like a lot of wins and time on king. And he's not a bad player at all. It's just he doesn't understand Anna. And when it's his turn is what he said. Like he doesn't know when it's his turn. And uh, I told him that if he wanted to get better at the matchup that he should, you know, message me and set up playtime so we could practice. But he never, he never did, and he never messages me back after matches, after I beat him. And it's not like, I, I kind of feel like he gets salty in a way because he loses. And it shouldn't be that way because, I mean, like, you know my friend, uh, don't drink, I'm shoot, <clears throat> the Julia player, and the, he plays Marduk Julia. Yoshimitsu. He plays a lot of characters, actually. Um, when I met him, he was playing Marduk, and I was beating him. And uh, he was beating my ass, too. It was kind of like, we're just going back and forth, but I think I was winning a little bit more. And uh, he messaged me and asked me if uh, we could set up a time to play, because he really wanted to learn more about Anna because she's so rare. And I obviously said yes, and we've been playing ever since. And I remember the first, one of the first videos I posted was me versus his Julia. And he kept falling for Anna's sweeps, uh, all the setups that I could think of. Um, and now he's just like scary as fuck to fight. And I have like the worst time with him. But he also says that he has a hard time with me getting to open me up as uh, as Anna, which is good because I didn't know Julia, I didn't know Marduk very well, so making a friend like that, um, that could teach me like over time, but just playing and not getting salty about who's winning and who's you know no we weren't keeping score or anything like that. We just would spend like hours fighting and just having fun, and I think that it's really important to find friends like that. Because it's just a game, and if you think, <laughs> if you think that um, your ego is more important than getting better, and or asking for help, then you're really missing out on a lot of fun with with the friend. <laughs> just like my old friend uh, that played Nina hyphen. I learned so much from playing with him versus Nina. I was scared of Nina when I first started, but I always wanted to beat her because she's Anna's big sister. And you know, the lore fights, everybody loves lore fights. So I always wanted to be better than Nina. And I feel like, I feel like I have a, a pretty good understanding versus her. And I can, I can fuck up a Nina pretty easily but not to say it's easy because it's not I mean if you're a really good Nina then I'm gonna have to to try extra hard but anyway as you've seen with um with hyphen or or my friend uh shoot they both like throughout our videos that I've posted they've They've gotten so much more better at their defense and their knowledge. They don't, they don't fall for anything. Even, they even know when to crouch block and launch punish and as full crouch uh, down for it too, which is an unseeable low. It's just like you, there's little things that you look for that you catch on to when you're fighting an Ana. Like you, you sort of get used to what they might do. I mean, because it's not like Anna in reality has a lot of options because she doesn't. You you begin to understand how weak a character is when you fight them enough. And it's not even just the person's style or anything like that. I mean, sure, like, that helps, like, you versus that one specific person. 
but overall we're all playing the same character and no matter what our styles are the character still has those weaknesses and they're pretty clear to see once you get used to it and this guy Mr. Rothstein like I said he's not a bad he's not a bad player he's just um I guess confused a little lost I mean he beat me the first the first round but within that first round I feel like I feel like he showed me everything that he was going to do right away. Because he does this, uh, he does like this high, it's like a, a left and a right punch. And then he goes into full crouch and then for me to, he wants me to whiff because I'll try to punish him because it's blocked. But he'll go into full crouch and after I whiff my jabs, he'll come up with a wall rising. Like I think it's a wall rising one, two or something. And then he'll go into it again. It's like, it's sort of a trap. And I caught on to it. And then, and then at the wall, if he's up against the wall, he will do his, uh, health, or not health sweep, it's the snake edge. It's like where he gets his arm and like sweeps you. I caught on to that, um, pretty, pretty early. And then his hop kicks too. He liked to do hop kicks at the start of every round. So that's why I started doing power crushes. I fucking hate King's power crushes. And uh, since I've known Mr. Rothstein, he's always liked doing uh, the alley cat kicks. I think that's what it's called. It's those spammy kicks, the lows, that stagger you. And if you don't block, then you're going to screw yourself up. And it's so annoying, but it's not hard to block. It's just it's annoying because I think it's safe on block. Like you can pretty much just go back into to guarding. But it's always fun to fight him. I mean, I don't. I really hope that he doesn't feel any sort of animosity towards me. I was actually surprised that he stayed this time because the last time I ran into him, he just left. And it kind of made me sad because cause I'm not trying to be a dick or embarrass anybody. Especially when I post videos and stuff. Like, if I post a video of you, I'm not trying to expose you or say you're bad or anything. I'm just, I just found the fight interesting enough to post. If I don't find a fight interesting at all, I'm not going to post it. If I, if I thought it was boring, then I'm not going to post it. But if I post it, it's because I thought it was fun. Even if I got my ass beat. <laughs> I think it's I think it's a lot of fun especially when when you're learning because my my friend uh, who plays Julia we had a session the other day and he, he I think I went like 16 and he went 24 I can't remember but he beat me up so bad but it was because I was I was trying so hard to adapt to him and come to find out, he was uh, he was trying to adapt to me too because I was adapting to him. So he had to change it up from what he told me. So I thought that was pretty cool. Like whenever you adapt to somebody, you're forcing them to adapt to that adaptation, <laughs> which is really cool. Like I, I have still have so much to learn on this game. Like I know like on Discord and like on Twitch and stuff, I like to talk shit and say I'm the Anna of the planet and I'm the best, da da da. Like I, <laughs> people who don't know me will probably take it like, oh, he thinks he's good. But no, I don't. I really, really don't. I think I'm bad. But uh, I have fun. I really do. I have a lot of fun on this game. And once I, once I feel like I've gotten better, then I'll start, um, Doing ranked more. I'm just that kind of person. I don't, I don't dive into stuff when I don't think I'm ready. Like a lot of people do. And oh yeah, I remember there was this one guy that I was. I think I was trying to be friends with him once, but he didn't like me. He said my Anna was cheesy and all this stuff. And it was when um, Negan first came out. He beat me with Negan one match, and then he leaves and then messages me, and he's like, I neutralized all your gimmicks, and after that you had nothing. 
and I won easy. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck? Are you stupid? Just because you beat me once doesn't mean you're better than me, all like, magically. And it doesn't mean that I suck either. Like, you won and done me, and you left. And then I, I ended up catching him again, and I whooped his ass, and I left. I almost got petty. I messaged him the bullshit he said to me, but I mean, what's that gonna do? Yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I know I really didn't talk anything specific, but I just wanted to commentate. Bye, guys.